you in place. Yep. Got a good view of the estate where this meeting is supposed to take place. What now? Albara's our target. He's supposed to be here tonight. Well, I'm glad I brought this rifle. But what's the deal with the scope? It can transmit images to me in real time. Aim at someone, and I'll run their picture through the database. See if we get a match. The longer you focus on a target, the quicker I can make an ID. The ID is all I need. And if the target's a scumbag, can I take him out? That's your call. If you decide to shoot, just make sure you don't do it if the target's inside of a camera or another person. We don't know who Albar is meeting, so taking anyone else out may have repercussions, depending on who their friends are. Don't waste shots. You'll give us away. They saw that. You'll need to take out the witnesses before they radio for help. Did she trigger finger? Mike, the guards have radioed in an alarm. Get out of there. Oh, shit. Place. Yep. Got a good view of the estate where this meeting is supposed to take place. What now? Albara's our target. He's supposed to be here tonight. Well, I'm glad I brought this rifle. But what's the deal with the scope? It can transmit images to me in real time. Aim at someone, and I'll run their picture through the database. See if we get a match. The longer you focus on a target, the quicker I can make an ID. The ID is all I need. And if the target's a scumbag, can I take him out? That's your call. If you decide to shoot, just make sure you don't do it if the target's inside of a camera or another person. We don't know who Albar is meeting, so taking anyone else out may have repercussions, depending on who their friends are. Owns a sports car dealership in Naples. Does a lot of international business, but no criminal record. Not our guy. Roman artist. Made a name for himself last year with a controversial exhibit in Paris. Some local juvenile offenses, but otherwise he's clean. Not our target. And nobody. Looks like the guards are clear. Moving up to the next position. Position. All right, let's begin. Well, she's a little underdressed. Definitely a cold night from the looks of it. All right, Mike. the news later, provided we don't make it. A Spanish celebrity talk show host. He's a known meth user, but nothing related to financing terrorists or arms smuggling. Private security. Ex-special forces. Not our man. But definitely a professional. 
He planned and led the assault that took back the hijacked British jet last year. I remember reading about that. Should I get an autograph for him? No. I work for the infamous Mike Thornton. Compared to you, he's small time. Security guard. He's clean. Dutch flower baron. He's suspected of dipping into the drug trade. But that's all I've got. Nothing really incriminating. I'm in position overlooking the chateau. A lot of guests tonight. I see. Might be very careful, I know. I don't want a mob after me before we have a target. He's a curator for one of the museums in town. His latest exhibit on the Crusades has drawn some fire, but otherwise he's clean. Albara, that's him. Take him out. Hold on. A lot of State Department and Interpol records. State Department says he's dirty. Interpol says his finances are legitimate, though. And... Mina, do I take him out? None of these State Department records are sourced. I can't tell where they came from, or when. Best I can tell, their intel was added to his sheet a few months before you left for Saudi Arabia. He's a member of Al-Samad, right? I don't know. I'd say yes, but, but I might be wrong. You can take him out or we can abort. It's up to you. I'm aborting the mission. All right, Mike. What's that beeping noise?
No sign of Alvara yet. Maybe he stood you up. I don't know. Something feels wrong. Hmm. Well, stay alert. I'm starting to trust your instincts. <laughs> Sorry, that's easy. Switch off your transmitter. If you reach for your gun, one of my men will put a bullet in your skull. Transmitter's off. I don't plan on reaching for my gun unless you make it necessary. Once I have the information I need, I plan to leave. You will not be harmed. Perhaps you thought you could enter Rome under the radar. You almost did. But you broadcast your location. Eventually. I had to. You were my last lead. I'm here to find out what Halbeck is doing in Rome and their ties to Alcimon. And what led you to believe that Halbeck has any interests in Rome or Alcimon? Are you denying that either one is true? I do not believe you would have come here without evidence. And what makes you think that? You aren't here in an official capacity. You are operating under Alpha Protocol. Interesting. Considering the program secret, I would have expected you to say traitor, unless you have insider knowledge. If you think you're the first to be abandoned by your government, you would be wrong. You are Michael Thornton. An American citizen, but you have traveled extensively since birth. A known freelancer. I'm an operative now. After Saudi, I had to change my five-year plan. So, is that it for introductions? You haven't even offered to buy me dinner yet. Reports place you as someone who prefers talk over action. You obviously read half the file. I like fighting, too. Besides, you're the one who's been doing most of the talking. Only because I need information. Provoke me further and I'll get it another way. You mean like raising your voice? You need to work on your approach. All you're doing is boring me. So you've done your homework. Congratulations. I know who you are too. You're Leyland's right-hand man. His lackey. Toady. Henchman. Chief of security. As of a year ago. Those gloves keep the dirt off? Ah, uh, yes. And the blood. When need be. Yes. You, on the other hand, have managed to enter Rome quietly. I didn't know you were here until an hour ago. You're skilled at keeping a low profile. No murders. No public announcement. Very impressive. What happened to Albara? Dead, of course. Once you'd ID'd him, well... His use to me was at an end. In less than a day's time, you have already managed to cause me considerable inconvenience. Now, tell me what you're doing here. I was tracking down a lead, and it looks like I've found it. I see. So you thought all you had to do was wait and we would speak. Interesting. What I don't understand, though, is why we're talking at all. Unless keeping me alive is important for some reason. I have orders, and I am a cautious person. So am I, and I think we have room to negotiate. No, I am not authorized to make deals. Besides, I believe you have nowhere to go for help. In that situation, it is a rare man who goes to his enemy's door. So, yes, this is a social call. A warning. You have proven yourself capable, but pursuing this course of action will not serve you any longer. Go underground, hide, but stay out of our way. Or else what? Or people you care about will start to die. We know you've been in contact with one of your fellow agents. That contact will die if you persist. And then we will kill you. Those are your terms. Allow you to carry out your mission and I stay out of the way. Yes. You realize I would be betraying my country. Yes. And that does not change my terms. I understand your feelings. And I encourage you to set them aside. So we're done here. I leave Rome, leave you to your plan, and that's it. Yes. 
What you do next is up to you, but there are only two immediate choices. Leave, you live. Stay, you die. You don't seem like the corporate stooge type. In fact, you seem like someone who doesn't take orders at all, especially from someone like Leyland. Are you questioning my loyalty? I am, but not in the way you think. Leyland doesn't have loyalty to anything except Halbeck. You seem like you have stronger convictions than that. Well, at least you are attempting to understand who you're dealing with. Commendable. Wars are often fought on psychological fronts. But not this one. Leave Rome. If we see each other again, it will be the last time. I confess, you slipped into Rome almost without us noticing. You were even more difficult to track after that. Between Halbeck and local authorities, the locals were the tough ones. No matter. Mr. Marburg found you. That must have been a surprise, meeting up for lunch like that. When we talked, he had a lot to say about Halbeck and some suggestions about my involvement with your corporation. Really? I can rarely get three words from the man. Feel free to have him threaten you whenever you get tired of listening to yourself. I'd be curious to hear more, and your first impression of Mr. Marburg. What did you discuss? We discussed business. Turns out both of us have experience with abuse of authority. He mentioned you being something of a smart ass, not taking things seriously. But Mr. Marburg was not always the best judge of character. Nor does he instill much loyalty in employees. Speaking of which, this woman entered the picture not long after your meeting with Marburg. She was in our office in Rome. Madison, I believe. Yes. I always wondered, did you ever regret getting her into this? It wasn't my choice. <laughs> oh, my, my, my. In the end, it was. Problem. The VCI employee I mentioned before, Madison, I think she's going to act. What do you mean, now? She's calling the operator and asking for you by name. She can't be working for Marburg, unless this is a trap. Who is she calling? The city directory. And maybe the police next. If she does... Can you intercept the call? Redirect it? What? Why? I want to know why she's looking for me. Okay, let me patch her through. Operator? Miss St. James? Uh, hello? Yes, is this the operator? No, Miss St. James, this is Michael Thornton. Oh, thank God. Mr. Thornton, please, you have to listen to me. I don't believe we've met before. How do you know my name and why are you calling? I have reason to believe your life is in danger. I know it sounds crazy, but... You don't say. I don't want to discuss the details over the phone. This line may be tapped. She's a sharp one. But it's important I speak to you immediately. Is there some place we can meet? Of course. I'll send you the address of a local restaurant. All right. I still have to hail a cab. I'll have one sent to your cross streets. Oh. Okay. I'll see you soon, Miss St. James.
Thank you for meeting me, Mr. Thornton. Mike, or Michael is fine. So what's this about someone trying to kill me? I work for the Veteran Combat Initiative, VCI. They're a global military contractor. My boss, Mr. Marburg, I think he's involved in something illegal. So I checked it out, and your name came up several times in our database. Well, I'm a popular guy. Maybe Marburg wanted to meet me. It was cross-linked to several contracts within the VCI. Termination contracts. Marburg must be jealous of my good looks. Uh, do you have the contracts? That'd be valuable evidence. Not on me, no. That would have been too much to hope for, I suppose. No worries, we'll figure this out. Mr. Thornton, I'm not sure what to do next. Go to the authorities? Is there someone I should notify, or...? Madison, you did the right thing warning me, and I appreciate it. I probably shouldn't have accepted your call. I think that may make things worse for you. For me? I think I was a little more worried about you. And I appreciate it. I'll do whatever I can to protect you. You need to look out for yourself first. Mike, Marburg is going to try and kill you. What are you going to do? I know Marburg. I know he wants to kill me. What I don't know is why he's here in Rome. I... Madison, you've already put yourself in danger by even meeting with me. I can protect you, but I need to know what Marburg's here for. I need those files. Are they in the VCI branch office? I don't know what you're looking for, but the VCI office in Rome isn't Marburg's personal office. He does most of his work off-site, or when he travels. But he's here now, so where would he store the information while in Rome? He has a villa. I've been there several times. If the files exist, I'm guessing they'd be there. Along with Marburg? Yes. Give me the address. Can you get me in? What? Passcodes, details on the security system, anything would be helpful. I can give you the address, but that other information... Trust me. If you can get me into the mansion, I'll get the information, and then your boss goes away for good. Mr. Thornton, Marburg is... I've never seen him angry, but everything about him... He's a dangerous man to cross. I'll protect you. If he gets by me, then no one can protect you. Uh, all right. Mr. Thornton, I trust you. If I can help you, I will. I can get you the address to the villa, and the names of the files you need to search for. Then that's all I need. Come with me. Anything on the news? Coalition forces report sporadic outbreaks of violence across the Middle East, believed to be part of a power struggle between rival terrorist organizations. Army spokesman Colonel J. Robert Powers tells INN that a suspected Osama terrorist training camp on the outskirts of Dis
Knights of Rome. The Roman Museum of Natural History opened up its Crusades exhibit earlier last week, prompting claims of religion. Narcissist much? Thornton, my apologies for relieving you of your weapons, but I'm sure you understand. Not really, but what Halbeck wants, Halbeck takes. I've been tracking your progress in Rome, and I've made a recommendation to my superiors. And? They dislike inefficiency as much as I do. You and I have a common goal, yet we're working at cross purposes. A common goal? How do you figure? Mike, I've been in your situation. You can't go back to the government. As for being left in Saudi Arabia, I think your superiors would prefer you not come back at all. I'd be lying if I said that hasn't been on my mind. That's because you understand the reality of the situation. So what's your offer? We could use agents like you, and you wouldn't have to hide or be hunted any longer. You would be doing the hunting. My situation has nothing to do with my mission or my faith in my country. Even if your country feels differently about you? It isn't my country. It's the people claiming to represent it. Assign blame where blame belongs. I see. A shame. I had hoped you would be willing to cooperate, but I haven't provided the right incentive. That was 10,000 volts. Beat Mr. Thornton until he can no longer stand, but leave him able to speak. I guess that's that. No, I just need my gear. Mina, do you read me? I'm here, Mike. Are you inside? Yeah, but they've got me locked in. Can you override the security systems? No, I can't patch through to security. I'm sorry, Mike. Would Madison know the codes? It depends who you want to help you out, Mike. I can patch Madison through, or I can stay on the line. Just say the word. Madison isn't trained for this. When push comes to shove, I'd rather you were backing me up, Mina. All right, Mike. to get out of here. Flashing. You might be able to listen in.
Nice bust. Not the time, Mike.
Got a present for you. Uploading the information now. Receiving. Sure is a lot of security. And that's that. Anything on the news? Coalition forces report sporadic outbreaks of violence across the Middle East, believed to be part of a power struggle. Conducted Osama terrorist training camp on the outskirts of Tucson was destroyed yesterday, allegedly in. Everything? No. I think we will need more than that. But I don't know what has happened in Moscow. I know nothing about these shipments. We will see. I thought you made sure we weren't being followed. Oh man, Marbury's gonna be pissed. <laughs> Russians. What the hell are they doing here? A lot of art pieces here. Looks like they're being shipped somewhere. Question and answer session. Getting some additional data now. Well, the authorities are on their way. So whatever you need to do, you do it quickly. They'll be here in a few minutes. Almost done, but I want to know who they were torturing. Let me ID them and then I'm out of here. All right, but hurry. Mike, you've got less than a minute. Got an ID and some papers he had on it.
warehouse. They're pulling up now. Mike? Huh? Oh. Sorry. Long day. I imagine. I saw what happened at the warehouse on the news. There wasn't any reports of you being taken into custody, though. So I wasn't sure what had happened. They spotted me at the warehouse, so I had to think quickly. I got the intel I needed, but it made getting out a lot harder. Are you hurt? No. Just need to get my second wind. I have to travel in the morning anyway, if I want to find out what's going on in the ruins. I noticed you had medical supplies in the cabinet. If you want, I could... I'd appreciate that. I'm starting to forget what it's like not to be shot at. I've got more scars than skin now. You look fine. They must all be under the shirt. Guess I heal fast, along with the good skin. Thank my mother for that. You should get some sleep medicine. Alright, I'm at the ruins. And the bike? It's close by. It's a nice ride. Al Samad? What are they doing here? Must be the connection she mentioned. I'm going in for a closer look. See how the renovations are going.
munitions finding their way into Rome. Better destroy them while I'm here. in architecture. No. Ancient Roman plumbing. With a minor in architecture. Your signal's breaking up a little, Mike. Must be the ghosts down here. Are you in the catacombs? Yeah, but not for much longer. I don't want to pick up any curses. doesn't end up like this if Halbeck fucks it up. You and me. transmissions to this station, but I'll need some time to trace the signal's origin. So, I just stand here and wait? Now you know how I feel. <laughs> just make sure nothing interferes with the station until I finish the trace. Then? Then? What then? We've got trouble, don't we? Protect the trace, Mike. If we lose it now... Don't worry, they're not getting anywhere near it. I got plenty of bullets. It looks like a dummy corporation. Cross-referencing with known contacts. Hold on, Mike, I almost have it. Erasing my tracks and the weapons.
Madison? Madison, are you here? Mike? Are you okay? Just tired, but I found what I was looking for. Was it enough? Can you take it to the authorities? No. If I do that, they won't respond in time. I have to do it. No, you don't. Let the police handle this now. You can let them capture Marburg, expose his involvement. I appreciate the concern. And I appreciate you trying to warn me about Marburg. I didn't want him to kill you. You had such a nice smile in the photograph. I was smiling? Must have been years ago. There it is again. You should do that more. I try. The job gets in the way. I've heard that before. I didn't mean to wake you when I got in. We've had a rough couple days. You didn't wake me. I was waiting for you to come back. I meant to stay awake longer, but you were gone for a long time. I was worried something had happened to you. I'm glad you're back. Me too. I was worried when I came back something had happened to you. Just dreaming. Good ones, I hope. Very. Anything on the news? Nothing about Marburg. Marburg was able to get the munitions into the country through Al Samad, but the warehouse was the destination of the bombs. He wasn't planning to destroy the warehouse, though, right? Was he planning to store the bombs there, use them later in Rome? That doesn't make much sense. The warehouse was on the outskirts of Rome. There's plenty of other storage areas he could have used. So there was something special about that warehouse. It's inventory. It's mostly art and museum pieces, right? I could call up the inventory and see if there's any possible name or location connection. Were any of the warehouse pieces outbound through customs? Maybe he was smuggling weapons and art pieces. I doubt it. It looks like the pieces were intended for a museum in the city. Although... Wait, no. Some of the pieces had already been shipped out. To where? I used to work part-time in restoration in one of the museums. I may be able to help. It's actually part of the reason Marburg hired me, I think. Marburg hired you because you used to work at a museum? Yeah, the Museum of Art in Rome. I think they have an exhibit on the Crusades showcase there now. What's wrong? Some of the pieces in that warehouse. I'm certain they were from that museum. He's going to bomb the museum. But why? I have no idea, but that's his target. I need to get there before he does. <laughs> 